Hello, I'm Jennifer Krause, and here are your latest headlines. Gunshots rang out on Vanderbilt's campus overnight after police say several fights broke out after an event at the Student Life Center. There were a couple of parties going on last night, including a pajama jam event between Vanderbilt and TSU involving students from both universities. At around 1 o'clock, a fight started outside the Student Life Center. Shots were fired from a vehicle that was leaving. We're told at least one person was hurt in the fight but had only minor injuries. No one was actually shot. The band Carverton is releasing new music today in honor of their lead singer who was murdered in February. Police say Kyle Yortlitz was robbed and shot to death outside his home by five kids, one of them as young as 12. The band is playing their album release show at Exit In Tonight. He was their front man and since he was killed, the band has received an outpouring of support. They want this album titled Chasing Sounds to be for Kyle. Tonight's album release party starts at 7, doors open at 6.30. The show is for 18 and over. If you're sad you didn't win the big Powerball jackpot last night, this may cheer you up a bit. No one won, so you still have a chance. And with no one matching all six numbers, that means the jackpot grows to something like $750 million now. We're told there were several winners who matched five numbers. The next Powerball drawing is Wednesday. And in case you were wondering, the lump sum cash payout for a $750 million jackpot is around $465 million. Now let's send it over to meteorologist Leland Statham for a check of your Sunday forecast. All right, around the Mid-South for today, look for some area showers out there. It's not going to be an all-day rain set up, but we do have some showers over the Mid-South. Here's a look at what is up for you today. Mid-60s this afternoon and then for tonight, 52. Area showers coming in tonight, even some thunderstorms. I don't think it will rain all night, but the chance for there does go up tonight and for some showers tomorrow as well. We'll finally get drier weather back in here for Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Although we've got the rain coming in for tonight, uh, today, tonight, and tomorrow. Tomorrow, right now, most of you will end up about a half an inch of rain or less. Go out and have a fantastic day and a great week ahead. I'm meteorologist Leland Stanton.